Get him. Rio. Good girl. Hell yeah. It's your first time with your new rod too, huh? Special occasion. Rod tip up. I'm gonna put him right in the cooler. Yeah, it looks like a mutton. Yeah, it's a mutton. It's a keeper, bring him in now. I think it's a keeper. Yeah, it's a keeper, bring him in. You can just double check, but I'm pretty sure he's good. Well, we met at the Hard Rock. Friends introduced us. It was, automatically I knew that like there was a connection. The minute I saw him, I kind of fell in love with his face. I really, his smile was warm and kind and he was rugged and that's what I love about him and he could fix anything and he's like everything I want and I saw it that day and shook my hand like a gentleman and I love gentlemen and southern gentlemen. She's kind, smart and funny and dorky. Very goofy, but I love it. Rob has taught me to kind of sit back and just admire things, really, because life can slip you, you know, so quickly before your eyes. It really can. And I've witnessed that firsthand. Well, she took a big risk. She moved up there to take care of me and switched all her schooling around for that. And, and it was a hard time for me. If I probably didn't meet her, I wasn't going to go back to chemo when I met her. And because of her is the reason I started going back. And, you know, like she pretty much saved my life, like really in essence. And she stuck with me all throughout, all the, sat there with me in the hospital, in the bed, and through everything. I had no question in my mind. I wouldn't even, you know, I would have done it any other way. Um, I was kind of like his backbone in the way that we were going through the treatment. And it was really tough, but our love kind of just held on and we really went through like everything. Um, whether it be five doctors, a week straight of chemo, all night long, you know, he really had that strength and perseverance through it all. I respected that in the guy and if he could do that, I mean anything is possible really. She was gonna pull through with me, you know, I felt like she took a big risk, you know, with someone who could die, I guess, you know. So it really hit my heart and you know, as we went, started going through things, I knew that she was the one I wanted to marry. You may kiss your bride. You know, there was a saying once that I heard and said, try to find, to try to find somebody you can live with is one thing, but to try to find somebody you can't live without is the special. I think you found